What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Noah here with Custom RC Moz. And in today's episode, I've got the second upgrade for my Traxxas Stampede 4x4 VXL, which is the Fast Eddy Sealed Bearing Kit, part number TFE312, made specifically for the Stampede 4x4. And I got this kit, of course, to address one of the most prominent issues that I found in my rebuild that I did in the last video, which was that the bearings are pretty worn down in this vehicle. So I'm gonna go ahead and completely replace every single bearing, much like I replaced every screw with the RC Screws Kit. Similar idea here, we're gonna get the drive line, especially all figured out and running smoothly. And of course, there's a few bearings that I'll replace in the steering bell cranks as well. Um, other than that, I'm just gonna go ahead and run through the places where we'll find these bearings that I need to go ahead and replace. And then I'm just gonna get to it. There's not really too much to say here, other than I'm just gonna take this car apart. Uh, take all the old bearings out, put the new ones in, and that's just going to be that. So we're going to find bearings in all the hub carriers uh, in each of the four tires, of course, here. So on the four corners, of course, in the front and rear diff housings, as well as the motor plate right here, uh, which is going to be the main one that definitely needs replacement. Of course, you're going to need them up in the steering bell cranks as well. Um, but other than that, that's pretty much it for this vehicle. It's really not too complicated. However, it's just going to be a little bit time consuming as most of these large rebuild projects are but hopefully the end result will be worth it So as you can see here, I've got the Stampede 4x4 all back together, now running the Fast Eddy bearings, and it's a lot smoother, so I'm very, very happy about that. Now this thing is going to function at max capacity. One thing I do want to note is that these bearings, although they are nice quality aftermarket units, aren't going to be much of an upgrade over the stock ones, especially if yours are functioning well. So I would wait to do this swap until you have completely shot bearings. The main advantage of getting this bearing kit is that it's a very organized and cost-effective way of completely replacing the bearings on your vehicle. So I'd highly recommend these, especially for the cost and of course the time it saves you from sorting out all the part numbers that you'll need for these certain sizes of bearings individually from Traxxas themselves. Another nice thing about this, especially for the Stampede 4x4 in particular, is that it really only took me about half an hour to get this swap done. These Traxxas 4x4 vehicles are super easy to work on, and for the differentials in particular, all I really had to do was take off a few screws here, pull off the diff case, I didn't even have to touch the skid plate or the shock tower, and go ahead, service it as I need to, and then put it back together, and that was really nice. I thought I was gonna go ahead and have to blow this thing up and get all the screws out just like I did in the last video. So very happy with that as well. Overall, I'm really excited to see this thing functioning again at max capacity. It's gonna be a lot of fun and hopefully it's gonna put a lot less load in the motor and of course the rest of the drivetrain now that I have good brand new smooth bearings on there. So yeah, I'll have the link to the Fast Eddy bearing kits down in the description below. You can go ahead and check one out and get it for your vehicle. And of course, that's gonna wrap it up for the video. Thanks for watching as always. Leave a comment, please subscribe if you don't mind. That really helps me out to show your support and I'll catch you guys in the next one.